my name is Julia Momose and I am the head bartender at Green Roof Chicago. Today I decided to make a cocktail that was inspired by Sunday lunches. Uh, growing up in Japan we used to cook curry rice every Sunday and then enjoy it with a cup of chilled barley tea. This cocktail though, uh, balancing out some of the acidity that we definitely need in any cocktail with Verjou Blanc. And then to follow up with that, to really give some of those delicious notes of curry, kumbia uh, kumel, which has notes of caraway seed, coriander, fennel, and cumin. And this offers that curry flavor that we're looking for in the cocktail. Just a quarter ounce of it, though, just so that we maintain some of the subtleties of the other ingredients. Pion de Charente from France, an aperitif wine base, starting off the must just slightly fermented and then fortified with cognac eau de vie. And then the star of the show, Mika Coffee Grain Whiskey. This is a beautiful Japanese grain-based whiskey. What I did though was infused it with barley tea. It's almost returning the barley to the whiskey for those soft notes that Japanese whiskey is so well known for. Before serving, and give the cocktail a little bit of a stir. These are cold draft ice cubes known for their larger size, which allows for a little bit longer stirring time. More time on ice means more of a chill, less dilution. This cocktail is served over a large piece of ice. We use a Kleinbell machine. It freezes up to 300 pounds. We stop at about 270 pounds uh, before we pull the blocks of ice. But it gives us these gorgeous, gorgeous, crystal clear blocks. So we're going to break it down so that the size that fits more appropriately into the glass. I'm using a three-pronged uh, Japanese ice pick. It allows for a little bit more control than a five-pronged pick. The balance is fantastic with ice picks you want. The pick itself to have the balance like you would a chef's knife as well. It gives you a lot more control. Allows you to almost be one with the, with the piece of ice or whatever you're cutting. I'm going to fit this piece of ice into a large rock sack. Slide that in there. This cocktail has been sitting on ice for just a moment. It's probably ready to serve. Now, with curry in Japan, it's traditionally served on a bed of perfectly cooked white rice with a side of these gorgeous red pickles called fukujimizuke. So I've pulled the pickling liquid from that and just a couple sprays over the top for the aromatics of ginger and vinegar that you get from that. And then finishing with some lemon oil for brightness. And here is the Colorton Street cocktail. Cheers.